to give and an everlasting love on CBS FM. That's the number five song on this week's Future Gold Survey with Bill Brown. Now we go with the music. CBS FM Weekend 101 weather. Sunny, pleasant today. Highs near 80. Clear tonight. Lows in the 60s. Sunny, mild tomorrow. Highs in the low 80s. It's 78 degrees in Midtown Manhattan. Girl, you're getting that look. FM and Mac Davis, uh, one of those songs that stemmed from back in time, way back in time, when men used to carry button hooks inside their rear pockets uh, for, you know, easy undoing and fastening of shoes and so forth. A lot of people thought that was a love song. I, uh... <laughs> of a 212-239-7177. Dick Heatherton, 2 o'clock this afternoon, and A&P's got another week of super savings, starting with boneless beef bottom round roast, ideal for pot roast, only $1.29 a pound. Seedless grapes, only 68 cents a pound. Check your local newspaper Wednesday for super coupon savings. City residents can pick up a copy of the weekly food ad at local A&P's, and with this week's coupons, get a 20-pound bag of A&P charcoal briquettes, only $1.79. And C&C Cola, 6 12 ounce cans, only 59 cents. Available at AP stores in metropolitan New York, New Jersey, Long Island, and southwest Fairfield County. spectacular Labor Day event is still going strong, loaded with the most exciting fashion values in town. For example, young men's boot or straight leg cotton denim Wrangler jeans, originally $13.99, now $9.99 a pair. Cotton corduroy jeans, $12.99 a pair. And ladies, we've got the new fashion handbags everyone is talking about. They're matte finish llama vinyls that you'd swear are leather at an unbeatable Orbax $10.99 each. Plus, ladies, get a head start for winter at Super Savings, too, in Orbax wool plush wrap coats with rabbit collars. Regularly $110, now we've slashed the price to an unbeatable $88 each. But that's not all. You'll find loads of unadvertised specials, too. So hurry to Orbax Labor Day event and save. Orbax, the fashion value place. more today than yesterday, but not half as much as tomorrow. Uh, uh, it's 19 before 2 at CBS FM. Bob Dayton with you at 6 o'clock this evening on the Golden 101. Olivia Newton-John, hopelessly devoted. It's not the first. star at 42nd Broadway anyway. That's Paperback Writer. That's the Beatles at 101 in New York. Bill, hello, Monday. 78 degrees as we await the arrival of Dick Heatherton at CBS FM, 2 o'clock. Here's Paul Simon. Slip sliding away. There you have it, the theme song for all the kids at Wildwood Crest going down the water slide. <laughs> Slip sliding away, that's Paul Simon at the Golden 101. Before Star Wars, there was, and there will always be, 2001, A Space Odyssey. Star Wars director George Lucas has this to say about 2001, A Space Odyssey. Stanley Kubrick made the ultimate science fiction movie, and it is going to be very hard for someone to come along and make a better movie, as far as I'm concerned. On a technical level, it can be compared. But personally, I think that 2001 A Space Odyssey is far superior. 
MGM presents a Stanley Kubrick production, 2001, A Space Odyssey. Now playing at the UA Rivoli, the Gemini 2, Cinema 150, Syosset, and the UA Bellevue. Golden 101. Here's a great idea for dinner tonight, a great grade A idea. Fresh, yellow, cooking good brand chicken. You see, every single cooking good brand broiler that comes up here from the Maryland shore is U.S. government grade A, and not every chicken company can say that. Cooking good broilers always meet or surpass grade A standards, and that's the government's highest mark. These plump corn-fed young birds have a golden yellow skin, and they're packed in ice and delivered fresh every day. So look for the round, red, and yellow cooking good wing tag. It'll say grade A right on the tag. Together, hello, big town. We've got mostly sunny, pleasant weather today. Highs around the 80 mark, clear tonight. Lows in the 60s, sunny and mild tomorrow. When you return to work, it's going to be up in the low 80s and beautiful sunny skies. 78 degrees in the city right now. And this is Steely Dan. Do it again. Dick Heaven will do it again next on 101 FM until tomorrow morning at 10. Have yourself a good day. Drive safely and goodbye. Solid go. WCBS FM. New York. 78 degrees and mostly sunny in New York. I'm Bill Gillian, CBS FM News. Good afternoon. A Rhodesian military communique is saying that 10 survivors of the Rhodesian airline crash were killed by black nationalist guerrillas after they crawled from the wreckage. The communique says the guerrillas stormed the plane, ordered the passengers to their feet, then shot 10 of them. The communique adds that one engine of the plane appeared to have exploded and the side of the plane was heavily scorched. There's speculation the plane was hit by a guerrilla missile. Eight known survivors of the crash are reported in good condition. The American protesters, including some New Yorkers who were arrested in Moscow, have been released. Two American newsmen and a cameraman also have been released from police custody. The group called the War Resisters League conducted the protest in Moscow's Red Square, while other members of the group were demonstrating for U.S.-Soviet disarmament in Washington on the White House lawn. In Washington, 11 people were arrested on the lawn. A New York City sanitation man, Chester Edwards of Riverhead, whose left leg was severed when he was hit by a car while working behind his truck, remains in stable condition today as doctors wait to see if surgery will be able to save his other leg. Doctors hope the emergency surgery performed to save the crushed right leg after the accident will prove to be successful, but they say it will be several days before they know. CBS FM News Time, one minute after two. You, you're the one. Quality? Well, that's something we had lots of a long time ago. We work so hard to be. We don't have any more. Oh, we still got some quality. Like your grandma's good cooking. Because you, you're the one. Quality? Is that good? Yep. Grandpa, I think I know another place. Looking for quality? When you choose McDonald's, you choose quality. Our hamburgers are made with lean 100% beef. What do you think, Grandpa? You know, Grandma would be proud to make a hamburger like this. And our fries are made from Burbank russet potatoes. They're so fantastic, they're world famous. At the McDonald's near you, at McDonald's everywhere, you get quality you can taste every time. At McDonald's. In this day and age, I wonder how they do it. We do it all for you. There is a report from the Associated Press today that a sixth union is expected to join the growing walkout against New York City's three major daily newspapers. The unidentified sources say the sixth union, the mailers union, is angered by unconfirmed reports that New York City's three daily papers may try to publish without the strikers who have closed them for 27 days. George McDonald, president of the mailers union and who also serves as president of the coalition of all the city newspaper unions, has called a meeting of the mailers union for Wednesday night. The Mets are trailing the Pirates one to nothing. Vetus Garolitis dropped the first set and then took charge to defeat Bob Lutz at the U.S. Open Tennis Championships today. The score 4-6, 6-4, 6-3, 6-4.
This victory advances the fourth seeded Garolitis to the quarterfinals in the men's division. The CBS FM Weekend 101 weather. Mostly sunny and comfortable this afternoon. A high in the 70s to the 80s. Clear and seasonable tonight. A low from the mid-50s to the low 60s. And it should be sunny and even warmer tomorrow with a high 75 to 80. Right now, 78 degrees. I'm Bill Gillian, CBS FM. Nick Hatherton. CBS FM.